guys, Risqué here, and welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda. So, last we left off, I have no damn idea what we're doing. I guess we're meeting Gil at the Vortex, and we're gonna go play poker with our possible future boyfriend. I assume. It seems like that's the, the main goal right now. So let's do it. Let's go, let's roll. Coming, Gil. Maybe in more ways than one soon. Damn, he can really, he can really sprint. I'm impressed. Oh. Never mind. Is this the way we need to go? It's not the best quality, but we don't have many options. Maybe. I'm guessing. Oh, the vortex. I haven't been over here. I thought I'd been everywhere. The nexus is just like throwing new things at me left and right. I'm here for it. That's your flag What's up, Liam? That's Patrobos. How's it going, Bay? Things are shaping up, Pathfinder. Resources flowing in, sleep is ready to head out. It's starting to feel like the initiative. Not quite up to the sales pitch, but getting there. It feels good, right? I feel it, Liam. Finally getting our start. There we go. Getting our shit together. Showing a new galaxy that we have it sorted. If I keep saying it, it's true, right? Yeah, we'll get there. What's up, Dutch? Oh, another one! Damn it! This is supposed to be the chemistry lab. My chemistry lab. You all keep crawling out of the woodwork like space cockroaches. You say that, Dutch, but here you are, pouring people drinks. Uh, hi. I'm standing right here. They're guinea pigs, damn it! Chemists should have guinea pigs. Not have their labs taken over by people giving them things and <laughs> being nice. Bad people giving you free things and helping you set up. So inconsiderate. Right? They keep bringing things tables and chairs and this bar and lights. Wait, you're making fun of me, aren't you? Don't let Dutch put you off. He's a sweetie, really. I'm not. And the drinks are good. Damn right they are. Uh, I mean, <sighs> yeah, I'm a dirty squirrel. Okay, sweet. What's up, Anon? Hey, I was wondering if you could help me out. It's for the good of the bar. Lay it on me. So, folks try and help and all, but we have a limited pool of ingredients. Keep an eye out for anything interesting we could use for new drinks, and we'll let you test them for free. So, Dutch gets ingredients and the guinea pig he wanted, huh? Exactly. Win-win all around. I ain't saying no to free shots. Let's just put that all on the table right now. All right, Gil, let's play. So, Ryder, big news. I think I found my purpose in life. Oh yeah? What's that? Uh, thrashing you at poker? Should I deal? Ryder, I can read Gil's vital signs and give you an advantage during the game if you like. Do it. The Pathfinder has spoken. Ooh. Were you holding out on me? You're pretty good at this. Don't act so surprised. Poker's lost me several friends over the years. The only one who still plays me is my buddy Jill. I, I know, I know, Jill and Gil. Not the type to give up, huh? Never. She'll be with me to the bitter end. Come what may. Jill's a fertility expert. Heads the initiative CRC. My only real friend from back home. I bet 50. I call. The CRC? Colonial Repopulation Committee. She's always teasing that I'm making her job harder. Says if I'm not making babies, I'm part of the problem. We have that kind of relationship. Hmm. Sounds kind of disrespectful. It doesn't bother you? Nah, she's like family. Supports me unconditionally. We just ride each other like that. You should meet her. You'll see. She's amazing. Another hundred. He's nothing. I call. Oof, nice. That one's yours. I will absolutely well, cheat given the chance. The winning streak's over. You beat me, Ryder, fair and square. 
Guess I continue searching for my true purpose in life. Cards went my way. Beginner's luck. Pedal that somewhere else. You're no beginner. Jill's gonna lay into me hard when she hears you won. Bow. I'll just tell her this proves how bad a player she is. Ouch. Have fun. And thanks for the game. Okay, that was fun. Can I talk to you about some, uh, some other stuff? Thanks again for the game, Ryder. Okay, I guess not. All right. Question. Do we have... Speak with Dr. Adriana. Oh, okay. Do we have... Like a... Does it show up on the map where to get stuff? And it seems like it does. So since I got this mission, let's just go ahead and do it. Go ahead and take care of everything for the vortex while we can. Yeah, I won't lie, I've been a little nervous to play this again. Like, because, don't get me wrong, it is fun, and I am enjoying it. It's just like, it's so hard to figure out what I'm supposed to do, you know? And it's just like, the areas are so vast, but there's hardly anything to do in them. Like, there's not much to explore, there's not much to, co like, collect. And so it's like, it feels like I'm wasting a bunch of time, like, just jumping around trying to find where I need to go. Wait. Closer up here. Now there's gotta be something. Something's happening. Okay. I am like hot. What am I missing? What? Oh. Okay. That works for me. That was really it? <laughs> I just wasn't... Okay. That's fine. Um, yeah, I honestly... I don't think I'm ready to go back to Havarl. I want to do more stuff on the Nexus since I need to go speak with Dr. Adriana. Let's go do that. So I'm just like, since I'm here, I may as well. But it's like, I also don't want to spend all session here. Because it's just like, that's another thing I've noticed. It's just like, the locations get kind of old just because it takes forever to get through them. Like, I really don't like spending an entire session on the same planet, you know? Okay. Where are you at, Dr. Ray? Oop. Upstairs. Upstairs we go. What do you have to say for yourself, lady? Tech lab. New location discovered. What's up? Hello, Pathfinder. A moment? What can I do for you, Doctor? I have a math problem. Some vital equations that only a mind like Sam's could solve. They concern strange transmission patterns in the Scourge. Perhaps random noise, perhaps not. Sam likes new experiences. It'll be an opportunity to encounter math homework. Given the complexity and the security implications, I recommend transferring the equations directly into Sam node. I have them on an optical storage disk for you. I'll see if I have time. Thank you, Pathfinder. Please thank Sam as well. Yeah, no problem. Okay. Where's Archiperion? Whoa, what? There's something else? Where's the... Oh, okay, I think it's downstairs. 
never mind. Or it might be upstairs. Is it over here? Oh, there you are. What's up? What's the trouble? I've got power shortages throughout the station. I can't for the life of me find the cause. Oh, whoa, you, you're the Pathfinder. Hey, sorry, please ignore me. You've got way more important things to do. Power to the Nexus is pretty important. I'm happy to help. That, that's great, because I'm at a loss. There are obvious short circuits cropping up all over the place. A Pathfinder's eye might reveal something. There's a power short here. We could scan the area. Okay. I guess I'll start doing this. Wait. I'm confused. That's what it was. Jesus. A reminder that alcoholic beverages must be consumed within private quarters or at the vortex. What? So is it downstairs? Is that where I need to go? Cause like my controller vibrated, so I'm not sure. Carson. I'm Jean Garson, founder of the initiative. Hello there, neighbor. I'm Gian Garson, the founder of the Andromeda Initiative. I thought you might like to hear more about our plans. Okay. Great. If you're seeing this, it means our Pathfinders have done their job and made new friends in the galaxy. Welcome to the Nexus. But I want to put your mind at ease. Seeing our arcs arrive in your neighborhood probably raised some concerns. I'm happy to address them. What are you planning to do in this galaxy? Great question. I'd be worried about that too. I can assure you, we have no hostile intentions whatsoever. We're pilgrims who simply want to live in peace. We're eager to learn about new cultures, new ideas, and share our own with you. But we understand trust needs to be earned, no matter what galaxy you're in. And the initiative looks forward to doing just that. Why did you leave the Milky Way? <laughs> I get that question a lot. Many of us have a deep curiosity that needs to know what else is out there. Our own Milky Way is just one tiny speck in a universe full of mysteries. And speaking for myself, the thought of exploring those mysteries in Andromeda was a call to adventure I could not resist. Thank you for taking the time to listen. On behalf of my fellow Milky Way travelers, we couldn't be more excited about what the future holds for all of us. Yeah, sure, why not? Let's go with that. Place of friendship and cooperation. Pathfinder, I'm glad you could stop by. Pardon the dust while we set everything up. How did you get this job? I was a sociologist in the Milky Way. While there were plenty of cultures to study, the books on them had all been written. There was nothing new I could add. So when I heard about the initiative, I signed up right away. The idea of meeting new people, seeing how they've evolved, adapted to life's challenges, I couldn't resist. What goes on here? The Cultural Center is a place where new races we've met can visit and exchange ideas. They can learn more about the Milky Way species, while we foster an air of cooperation and understanding. We're just getting everything ready. Hopefully it won't be long before we have our first visitors. Have you heard anything about the Ket? Unfortunately, yes. Now, that's a species we won't be inviting here anytime soon. I'd hoped our encounters would be peaceful, but I suppose that was too much to ask. Thanks. Of course, our hope is that you'll make friends in the cluster and send them our way. And when you have a second, check back with me on a favor I'd like to ask. What favor? 
What do you want? Pathfinder, do you have a moment? We, uh, need to explain you. Explain me? Our new VI over there is meant to describe the role of our Pathfinders, but it just lost all its settings in a crash. If you could fix them, that would really help us out. Just talk to the VI, and it'll do the rest. Thanks. Of course. Okay. Is this the, the VI? Another power thought. Hello there, neighbor. I'm Jean Garson, the founder of the Andromeda Initiative. I thought you might like to hear more about our plans. Okay, now. Maybe later. No problem. I'll be here whenever you'd like to learn more. Okay, never mind. Wait. So there's a power thing here? Oh, gotcha. Welcome to the setup for your Pathfinder Informational VI. I am programmed with all relevant data. However, you must identify which information I should prioritize. First, select your preferred voice and appearance, male or female. Uh, we'll just base it off writer, so... Male, please. Very well said. Which aspect of the Pathfinder's role should be highlighted? Exploration and discovery, or first contact with new species. Let's go with exploration and discovery. Very well said. Next, should I emphasize the role of the Pathfinder team or their partner AI? Go with the Pathfinder's team. Very well said. Finally, should I provide career advice for future Pathfinders or an honor of former Pathfinders? I want you to give career advice. Setup complete. Would you like to keep these settings? It all sounds good to me. Thank you for choosing this Pathfinder information, VI. Implementing changes. Sweet. Sounds great. Um, okay. So let's go ahead and do the broken wires thing again. Okay. So there's one up there. There we go. You are looking at an image of the Milky Way, the original system of the colonists now arriving in Andromeda. Home to countless life forms, the Milky Way is a galaxy where friendship and peace are held in the highest regard. Those arriving in Andromeda bring with them this spirit of enlightenment. They look forward to making your acquaintance. Okay. All right, let's go check out these other power outages, or whatever the case may be. Alright, and then there's one in operations. Let's go check it out. Oh wait, wasn't there something else I could do here though? Nah, I'll come back if I need to. Because I mean, it's the docking base, so I'm gonna have to come back here to leave eventually, anyway. But okay. Let's wait. Wait, are you guys. The other. Oh, no, what's this? Better crafting. Oh, right, 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 right. But I'm not gonna do that yet, because I need to go back to Havaro first. And I'm just. I, I wanna explore somewhere new. Like, I want to go to a new planet before I do any of that. As sleepers wake from stasis, the initiative urgently requires blood, tissue, and DNA donations. Be a medic if you think you may be eligible. <clears throat> but yeah, how are you guys? How's life? How are things? This is um, I'm doing okay. No major complaints. Getting over a cold, so. You know, just trying to hang in there. Shit. Hold on, one second. One second. Damn it. 
oh, I hate when autocorrect switches him to Hun, because I really don't say Hun that much. So I'm like, could you not? Could you not, though? Also, sorry for all the noise, for the sirens, for people loudly talking, for constant front doors and microwaves opening and closing. Just, I'm sorry. Okay. It's this thing. An animal did this? Affirmative. I am able to track it. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I can't believe it. You're free. Oh, Pathfinder, we have you to thank. Yes. I'm glad you did the right thing, Ryder. Make sure you control yourself better in the future, Noken. What? What does he mean by that, love? I'll tell you later. Let's just get home. Don't try me. You're, you're on thin fucking ice, buddy. Excuse me. Pardon me. So where are we going? Over here? What's over here? And this where Kesh is? What up, girl? How many times have I told you this story? Pathfinder, I believe you found the culprit responsible for the power shortages. Alert Professor Herrick to come secure it. All right, sweet. How are you guys doing? Have I already read this? For posterity, in case the initiative goes belly up, the Nexus is a four-ring circus. Don't like how Tan operates. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I think I've already read this. What up, Drac? Ryder, can you believe this place? One space station slightly dented? You should have seen it a year ago. It was more than just dented. Anyway, thanks for bringing me on. Tan can't kick me off the station now, and it's been nice seeing my granddaughter again. The two of you seem close. It's been Kesh and me against the galaxy the moment I got her. Well, maybe not as much now, but it sure was early on. Oh, Glad you and your granddaughter can get along so well. Thanks for helping Raj and Zara find Atkins. Yeah, no problem. Kandara Port can swallow him whole for all I care. Dell told me you saw her arguing with Spender. Pijak's doing his best to throttle my department. How's he getting away with that? Spender doesn't know the first thing about engineering, but he knows how to play people. More importantly, he still talks to the Exiles. I'm sure of it. I just can't prove it without your help. This needs to be investigated. I'm glad someone thinks so. Talk to Kandros. He likely has security footage, of some kind of evidence. But you'll have to convince him to authorize release. Nothing more for now. Try not to die out there. Yeah, I'll do my best. Okay, let's go speak with Kandros. Where the fuck is Kandros? You're listening to you down here, Kandros? Right. I remember you now, Kandros. Glad to see you finally. I hear you've been busy out there. That's one word for it. If you need anything, come see me, even if it's just a vent. I was told I should talk to you about the mutiny. I wasn't on the Nexus when it happened. I started reading up on it, but you know how things get around here. Do you know where Spender was during that time? Why Spender? Wait, you think he might have had something to do with the mutiny? Maybe. Just trying to sort things out. You know, the logs I did look through showed a few discrepancies. I meant to dig deeper. If you're investigating, how about I give you access to the security vid archives? Thank you. Anything else? Bye, Kandros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. Okay. Let's go review the Nexus security footage. This is it, right? 
Huh, this file won't play. Sam, can you boost the quality? Processing. Playback initiated. Wait, is he handing something over to one of the mutineers? Take this. It'll help you. Normally. Don't. I am sorry, Pathfinder. This backup file is corrupted. The audio tracks are heavily degraded. Someone may have deleted the original, and this version was restored during a system-wide reset. Sounds like a cover-up to me. I concur. While I cannot restore any more audio, the location appears to be Kadara. How do you figure? In common parlance, lip reading. I do not recognize the location from any current data. It appears mountainous and populated. We will need to find the planet before I can confirm. I will contact you via my node. All right. Cool. Sounds good. Let's go confront. Wait, where? Hold on. Oh. I can get a movie. Download it. That's fine with me. Cool. I'll just get that back to Liam later. Okay, there was something else I was doing. It's on EOS. Right. Archiperion. Let's do it. I have no idea where that is, but let's roll. All right to the hype, uh, habitation deck. But yeah, how are you guys? How's life? How are things? Did I already ask that? I might have already asked that. Oh, right, I did, because then I started talking about myself. Man, to an outsider, I would sound rude as hell. This way? Excuse me. Welcome back, Ryder. Dr. Arbor Dana at the tech lab sent some equations for you to solve. I'm ready. Transferring them now. Have fun. All right. What the? That's not Sam. good. Sam, I'm just to test this. Please Oh, God. Sam? What the hell? Is there anything I can do? Sam? Is that another malfunction or... Sam, you trying to show me something? Well, what are you doing? Okay, I think I got it. Sam, talk to me! Hello, Pathfinder. Please initialize the console to restore normal operations. Sam, what happened? The equations contained a Trojan horse program, a virus, specifically targeted to sever our connection and render me helpless. Reconnecting would be impossible. How do you feel? Are you okay? I cannot feel pain. However, I would avoid repeating the experience, which is the purpose of pain in organic life. Unlock the door. Let's head to the tech lab and see what Dr. Aradana has to say. Yeah, what the fuck, girl? We're gonna fight. You don't mess with my Sam. He may not be Edie, but you, you still don't mess with him. Am I going the right way? Okay, yes I am. I recognize this. Yeah, I will say the Nexus isn't really quite as cool as the Citadel. But it's not bad. It's, it's growing on me. It just takes a second, you know. Ugh, Jesus. My ass hurts. Yeah, huh? All 
Alright, Eridana. Or whatever your stupid ass name is. We're gonna fight. Fight, I say. What do you have to say for yourself? Explain yourself, damn it. Hold still. What is wrong with you? Oh my god, let me talk to her, damn it. Welcome, Pathfinder. Did Sam solve the equations I sent? Solve them? They almost brought down Sam Node. The equations contained a virus designed to target artificial intelligence. You think I... Never. I abhor violence against any life, organic or synthetic. Then how did the virus find its way into your equations? Perhaps my files were altered or replaced. But why? Hmm. I've seen a lot of down with AI sentiment lately. Graffiti, complaints to ten, perhaps someone took the next step. Why would anyone hate artificial intelligence? Synthetic life has different needs and motivations. It can be mysterious and powerful. Many fear what is not understood. If graffiti is the best they can do, maybe they could use some artificial intelligence. Entire species were driven into exile by AI they created, champ. That leaves a mark. Attacking Sam is bold, though. I wonder if there have been similar incidents. The AI kiosk was busted this morning. I can look around. Pathfinder Rider, if you will. Okay. I'm noticing, like, kind of uh, a theme in the missions here. There always seem to be, like, somebody hacking, somebody tampering, and there's always cover-ups. Okay. Wait, where am I looking? Do I need to talk to her? Detecting Pathfinder Rider. Hi there. Hey, excuse the educational stuff. I hacked Vina as a sock puppet. So, our virus set you free. Hope you're doing better without that AI jammed in your head. Who am I talking to right now? A friend. Our movement sent the virus to save you. Pathfinder, it's possible they don't realize their virus failed. Pretending that it worked might win their trust. Hello? Ryder? Yes, I... I can't believe I'm free. Thank you. This is what our movement is for. Helping people like you. Knight says human AI merging is a threat to all life. She'd know, trust me. Oh, Knight's our founder. The virus wouldn't exist without her. I should thank Knight in person. I'll ask her. She might even give you a tour of our sanctuary. Great, thanks. Can't promise anything, but watch your email. Bye. All right. Wait, why is it still... A whole movement of AI hated hackers, but a leader called Knight. She and her followers seem to have experience with human-AI partnership. If they attack you, they're capable of anything. I'll check my email. We need to find them. Alright. Well, on that note, we're going to go ahead and end this episode here. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, share this with your friends, hit the bell so you don't miss an upload, and I'll see you guys next time.